This is Witch's Rock, Costa Rica. It's home to some of the best and most famous waves in the world. And I'm going to try to ride it. I've been surfing since I was about 6 years old. When we moved from New York City to Colorado, I had to put surfing on the side. However, in the summers, we would still go to Long Island where I could continue surfing. Then in 2020, when COVID happened, I couldn't travel for almost 2 years, so instead I road tripped to California for a month. I would leave the house, walk 2 minutes down the beach, and surf for hours. In 2021, we flew out to New York to spend another summer in Long Island. That's when I first heard about Witch's Rock. It was this magical surfing spot you could only get to by a one hour boat ride. The waves were amazing and there was a big rock at the center, hence the name, which is rock. From that moment, I knew I had to surf it. We just walked out and I'm now walking down the thing. It's a lot fucking harder here than it is in Colorado. Finally, I was there. It was even more beautiful than I imagined. I was set to surf at 6 a.m. on Wednesday, giving me three days to enjoy myself to the fullest in this amazing place. We're doing the final pack up. I have this massive bag here. Show them the bag. Okay, let me take this off. Show them the bag. Has the, um, it has the drone. It has the um, has the drone. Has the camera. Has uh, what else does it have in it? The batteries. Batteries. The two, microphone. Two wetsuits. Two wetsuits. We're all packed. This is a five-hour trip right here. Hola. Hola. Right here. Okay. Sick. Thank you, man. Hey, 